Maple Brook and Jim, investigators are trying to piece together exactly what happened last night, which led that man to attack one of his own children and his children's friend. They're now recovering here at the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. It's just a violent rampage uh, that did not end well. And uh, we're hoping at least that the, the, the young kids will survive. Philadelphia police say officers shot and killed a man after he stabbed his eight year old son and a friend of the boy around seven Wednesday night. Both children remain in critical condition at the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. The eight year old has his throat cut, he's got multiple stab wounds to his chest. 13 year old, multiple stab wounds to the chest. It's unclear what motivated the attacks on the 6200 block of Hazel Avenue, but after assaulting his 15 year old daughter, then stabbing the two boys, police say the man ran off to a home about half a mile away on the 700 block of Cobbs Creek Parkway. Enters under the premise of wanting something to eat and then immediately grabs a knife and uh, actually slices the 70 year old. Police say the suspect slashed the elderly woman in the face and assaulted a 42 year old woman at the home who tried to intervene. When the suspect tried to leave the home, police say as many as nine officers fired at him. He's got uh, his hand in his pocket. Uh, they tell him several times to take his hand out. He abruptly takes his hand out and uh, they fire multiple times striking him. Police say this man did have a criminal history. His 15 year old daughter told authorities that he may have been high on drugs at the time. Authorities also found up to three knives, broken blades, and a meat cleaver at the two crime scenes. Live at the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia, Anita O, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.